about Minecraft bosses that you didn't know. Back in the day when uh, resummoning the Ender Dragon n wasn't a thing yet, uh, the Ender Dragon was only one, and Notch actually gave it a name, and the name is Gene. You know that the Ender Dragon can destroy almost any block, even water, and that there's only four blocks that it can't destroy. Those being iron bars, obsidian, and stone, and of course, bedrock. Ender Dragon can't be named, while the Wither actually can. And as a joke, it was said that his name is Simon, but there was no actual name like with the Ender Dragon. Just like a group of geese is called a gaggle, a group of cows is called a herd, and a group of pandas can be called a cupboard, bamboo, or even embarrassment. One group of Endermen is actually called a haunting of Endermen. Those were even real-world facts, not just Minecraft. You can thank me for that in the comments. Have you ever heard of the terrifying monster called the Ravager? Well, you probably have if you ever experienced a raid. Well, you, you know that these beasts are quite terrifying, but actually, when it comes to soft little animals, like the rabbit, ravagers are actually scared of them. Well, not anymore, but because this feature was removed due to lore reasons, but in a certain version, before the full 1.14 village and pillage update in the snapshots, the Ravager was actually scared of little bunnies, and they didn't even have to be the rare killer bunny. Have you ever played Age of Empires? Well, I haven't, but there is a reference, because when an evoker gets near a blue sheep, he starts using his magic and turns it into a red one and a sound can actually be heard saying Wololo, which is from the game. And this refers to wizards from said game that turn enemies into friends. Did you know that there is a big sign on the Elder Guardian saying Jeb? Well, you probably didn't because you can't actually see it, but if you look in the game files, you can see that in the texture of the Elder Guardian, Jeb clearly signed the art. Minecraft 1.21 might actually have a new boss in added to the game. Well, a couple months ago, the official Minecraft YouTube channel actually uploaded this video. Do you have a plan for adding a new boss? And yes, that is the question, is there gonna be a new boss and a villager nodding its head, referring that probably, yes, there is gonna be one. We can only hope and stay tuned and subscribe because I will make a video on the boss when it comes out. Just like there is an Ender Dragon, there was actually supposed to be another one. This one was supposed to be added a long time ago, and it was supposed to be red, but they decided not to add it after Minecraft was bought by Microsoft and Notch left. I guess Gene is still the only dragon in the game, unless you play mods than this. Did you know that? There's actually multiple withers. There's actually also a pink variant of the wither that was in a April Fool's snapshot 15w14a, and also a different pink wither that was in the Minecraft 2.0 update, which was also released on April Fool's. Did, did you know that the uh, skulls that the wither shoots do a lot more damage than if you summon them manually. It's 
see, if you summon a Wither Skull, then this skull only actually does 5 magic dama damage, while the Wither shoots Wither Skulls that do much more. Speaking of different Withers, uh, did you know that the Wither on Bedrock and the Wither on Java are actually completely different? With the Wither on Java Edition having 150 hearts, which is 300 health points, and the one on Bedrock having double that amount, which is 600 health points and 300 hearts. More health is not actually the only thing the Wither on Bedrock has that the one on Java doesn't, because the Wither on Bedrock actually has an exclusive dash attack, which, well, hurts quite a bit. Watch right here to find out which boss is actually the strongest one.